Creepy clown sightings are happening across the country, and it's no laughing matter. There are concerns that the trend will grow as Halloween approaches. Here's Jamie Yukis. It's a trend spooking the nation, creepy clown sightings. Now they're threatening school districts. Police and Homeland Security are investigating scary Instagram posts in Philadelphia. The posts from over the weekend all use the word clown. Some even talk about blowing up schools. The unusual reports started surfacing back in August in Greenville, South Carolina. Right there at that tree back there. Children told police that clowns tried luring them into woods by offering money. Since then, sightings keep increasing. On New York's Long Island, social media threats from anonymous clown accounts kept elementary children inside during recess. Second clown, I guess he was kneeling. Parent just, Kalik Owens. Nobody knows how to defend against it because we don't know if it's a prank or if they're really trying to harm people. Now police are using social media to track down the costumed offenders. In LaGrange, Georgia, police posted about issuing warrants for four people on charges of making terroristic threats and disrupting public schools. In Kentucky, this young man was arrested for trying to scare people in a ditch. Police have arrested at least 12 people across the United States for participating in menacing stunts or making false reports. In Houston, Texas, this Instagram post shows clowns threatening to kidnap students or kill teachers. Parent Rochelle Hudson. This would make me drive my daughter to and from school. For anyone who thinks this is funny, police say there is at least one deadly incident linked to a clown hoax. In Reading, Pennsylvania, a 16-year-old was stabbed to death in a dispute, and he was wearing a clown mask. Rena, a 29-year-old now faces first-degree murder charges in that case. Mm, I can see why parents are concerned. Mm -hmm. Jamie, thank you.